Hello, alright guys. Now I'll be doing you a video on eCitizen. I've been getting a lot of questions. What is eCitizen? What is eCitizen? What it does, and how? What you need to get started. So in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to get an eCitizen account. So first of all, you have to start to go to your search engine and search eCitizen. Dot do dot ke. I'll put the link on the description of this video. Once you are in the eCitizen platform, the welcome page, you can see what it is. Basically, eCitizen is a platform that gives you a gateway to all government services. You can apply them online. All you need is a eCitizen account. So once you are in this, <coughs> once you are in this platform, you can just create an account. You click on create. You click. You click on eCitizen Kenyan Citizen. If you are Kenyan citizen, if you are a foreign citizen but living in Kenya, you will choose this one. For now, we have to create our one for a Kenyan citizen. Then on this, <coughs> you have to input your ID number. So the first configuration is that you have to have an ID number if you are applying for any serv any government service. You have to have an ID number for children. You can use your parents' account. So you you input your ID number and the first name of your and your first name. Click on validate. When you validate, you will see your details here. Now then you can proceed to input your email. Input your email address. Confirm your email address. Then you. Input your mobile phone number input your <coughs> the password that you remember then you click on this that you have the terms of service and click continue so once you once you click continue on the mobile number that you have inputted your 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 mobile number is your mobile number you will get a verification code so you just press your send a verification code you will be sent a verification code via text from me once you get the code you input the your code and you verify code now you are done so what you can see here now is the dashboard for the then services that you can get this one number one service here is for <coughs> immigration if you want to apply for a passport and what the old visa if you want to apply for register your business online you just come to this tab if you want to apply for a good product or police clearance you come to this tab then if you want to get services from the office of the Anthony general ntsa <coughs> And basically all services of the government for political party registration, if you want to see which political party you are affiliated to, if you want to make any service to PRA, National Construction Authority, NEMA, HELP, you get all the government services on this platform. It's basically a one a want a one stop shop for all government services. And like there before we are used to go to different of government offices, maybe you are sent to this office, this office. Now the government came up with this platform so that it can make the work easier for citizens. So you just come to this this one, get service, get service, and you have done most most videos on this, so you can get other videos. If you want to apply for a passport, you can watch one of our videos. It's already on YouTube. If you want to apply for a business name, you can also watch one. It's in our YouTube. Yeah, and if you want to get help to to apply these services that's where quick office comes in and just request request us in our website and we'll do that those services for you thank you very much see you in the next videos